Michelle, how are you okay. today? Good, how are you? Pretty good, pretty good. Like I said, my name is Chris, and uh, I'm just here to help out and try to see if we can uh, work out a deal where we can actually buy your house. Um, I know that uh, she was telling me that the house needed a little bit of repairs or something to it. Is that still correct? Yeah, like, uh, like the yeah, a little tan wear inside, like uh, on the bathroom floors and the uh, kitchen cabinet, but, uh, yeah. So, kitchen... Other than that, just need to do is paint it. So, kitchen cabinets, painting, um, and what was the other part? The bathroom, the bathroom, the bathroom, you know, before they leave, they don't clean, they might stand there. Oh, okay. So, you had tenants in this property before? Pardon me? You had renters or tenants in this property before? Yes. Oh, okay. How long were they there for? Um, four or two years. Oh, okay. So they did a lot of damage in two years, huh? Yeah, I don't know how, because I live in my house for, I mean, 15 years. People come in to look like new, but I don't know how the people can do that. That's why I said, like, I'm not, and because before that, I mean, my husband already prepared everything. And then they come in, they say, what the heck is after two years? Like, you live like this, I'm not going to sign more, any more contract with them. And I say, I have enough. Uh, Wow, I can understand that. You get a bad tenant, that can change everything. So um, so they were renting it. They uh, pretty much moved out now. So they're done with everything. They don't need to go back to get anything out of the property or anything like that? No, they already moved now everything. The house is now completely empty. I already had people come in and clean everything out, like completely up, up to the bottom, even basement, not one piece of trash in there. Oh, okay. So it's cleaned up and ready to go. Okay, and so you were... Yeah, all you could need to, could need to repaint and redo the kitchen, or is it, and then that, that's about it. All I right. mean, like, if I want to do it, I can have people come in and do it, but I think I just have enough. Right, yeah, I can definitely understand that. So to get those repairs done, what do you think it'll be about, uh, what do you think it will cost to get all of the stuff done to make it rent-ready again? Um, I would think about, I would put $5,000 in there, everything would be good to go. Oh, because so there's not, not much of cabinets in there, there's only few cabinets, the bathroom is small, or you just need to have a few pieces of tile in there, we do with a new toilet, new uh, thing, thing like that, touch up and paint, I don't think it would cost that much, so for me, about $5,000. Oh, okay. So it's a light rehab then. Yeah. Okay, that, that's fine. I mean, just cosmetic. Yeah, cosmetic. But the structure is nothing damaged or anything. I oh, mean, okay. uh, a couple doors. Yeah, couple doors. Don't tell and me they were. Don't did. tell me they were punching the they walls or punching the doors. The I don't know. They punch. However, that uh, all the panels, some of the panels falling off. If I didn't inside the house, I don't know. <laughs> right, right. I can understand that. I don't know what happened. So, in the event we are able to work out everything, how soon would you like to close? Well, if it's matching the price that I want to sell, then it's closed as soon as possible. As soon as possible. And you were asking how much for your house again? Like yesterday, I asked for you, like, uh, checking, when that is proposal, like, I checked on Zillow, there is 127 something. So, with that, I just want to say, you know, I could take off you for 
remodel whatsoever. So I was looking at the bottom. I had to take a, a hundred k. Other than that, I wouldn't. A hundred k, a hundred thousand. Okay. You know, and I want to be fair, and that's that's our main goal to make it a win-win situation for you. So you're happy with everything, you and the husband. So, um, is he going to be helping you with this decision, or is it pretty much your loss? I am the boss. Ah, look at that! How did I know? <laughs> I am the boss. You, you, you do what you say. You say jump. He say how high. <laughs> Okay, so perfect, perfect. So you want a hundred thousand for it. It needs about five thousand in work. Um, so yeah, I mean, it, it sounds like something we may be able to do. Um, what do you plan on doing with all the money when you cash it out? You gonna go buy more property or something, or? No, I just wanna pay off my mortgage. I could, I currently have about two thousand dollars in my bank account. Living. <laughs> oh yeah, pay down that mortgage you already got at home, huh? Yeah. That's why it's time for me to cash it out because uh, I just oh, I cannot do it anymore. And I cannot get up in the middle of people, middle of middle of night. Oh, I don't have a heat because it's tomorrow. I have to look in for somebody. So I'm right, done right. with that. I need nobody to interrupt my sleep anymore. <laughs> I know that's so right. I, so in the event you was not able to sell it, what are you planning to do? No, I think it's going to sell it. I... I I still had people calling me all over the place, but I just haven't, do not know what to do yet. And Gloria, she's very consistent at calling, so I try to return the call, but I have a lot of phone calls. I have a lot of people, but, you know, but during this time, and because the people just get out too. But before I had already had the people calling a lot, they say, do I want to sell? I say, whenever I'm ready. I'm not ready yet at the point. So now I think I'm ready to call, so. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, Gloria, but she I'm will find. that she... house right there, the corner, and the big rope like that, I, I would sell it no, uh, no time. Right, right. And then also, I don't know if you were asked or not, would you consider taking a monthly payment for it until you were paid off in full? No, I wouldn't want to take the payment. I told Gloria I would take the whole, you know, sale in price. So you're mm -hmm. saying all cash is the only way that you would sell it, is that correct? Yeah. Okay, no problem. So we can definitely get you a cash offer. And uh, I did want to let you know you are in good hands. You know, Gloria and I, we will take good care of you. Um, we make this a smooth transaction for you, you know, and so you don't have to worry about dealing with, you know, real estate commissions, fees, um, you know, appraisals and a lot of, you know, stuff, you know, traditional sales. I know you know about it because you've got multiple property probably, right? And so... Um, you know, we try to make it a smooth transition. Yeah, that's for why. You. And that's why if I had to go with all the commission, that's why I wouldn't tell you. That's why I would want to hire so they have to drag that out. That's why you say I asked Gloria yesterday. No commission, nothing. As the that's why I subtract of all the things that consistent. I already have that encounter, and then I subtract. That's why I say the bottom line. I would want a hundred. If I had to go with the realtor commission. I would go with higher. Right, so they take right. all that out. The Congress that he wanna wanna take it back. Okay. They already in, um, you know count all the in already. That's fine. So um, let me ask you this: In the event we wanted to take a look at the property, how do we go about seeing it? How do you um? Or do you have do you have pictures? Or do you have pictures or something of it or anything or? Um, no, I didn't take a picture. I mean, like, can only, if you want me to take a picture to send you, I can go there and take a picture. I will, I still go there every weekend to check in on the house. Oh, so you're really, planning um, to go on this weekend? Okay. So, yeah, that, I mean, so that, that sounds if good. If you want to, I can uh, swing by and just take a picture and send you. But, uh, I mean, like, on the outside, you can already see that on the Google, you can see the house outside. 
Yeah, and the biggest thing we were wanting to see was more so about, you know, what repairs are needed and things like that, which it sounds like is pretty simple stuff. Um, we just want to, you know, get a good visual of that so we can see what we're going to have to put into it. We usually try to fix them all up to either hold them as a rental or sell them on an MLS after fixing them up. So every case is different. So, you know, it just depends on the situation there. Um, so, yeah, so, okay. I, so you say there are other buyers and uh, we, you're able to work out everything you want to close as soon as possible. Um, let me see here. And uh, you are able to get some pictures. Uh, what else we got here? I think we got everything good here. So if we're able to agree on everything, um, are you ready to get some paperwork started to, to sell your house? Yeah, yeah, we would like you to see. Like we would like to get a couple of pictures. That's not a problem. But uh, I would also, um, you know, it sounds like it's pretty decent. You know, I don't think there it should be any problems as far as um, everything else. But we will, we would like to see it too. Um, so yeah, if you can get some pictures and send them over, that's one thing. And then also, I just wanted to know if, if we were able to work out everything and, uh, and come up to a price that you want. If you were able, if you were ready to get some paperwork started. Yeah, if we agree on the prices I want, of course, I will do the paperwork to get going. Okay. So, yeah, we'd love but to take a look at those. I'm not going to do any paperwork if we not agree on anything yet. That's fine. Right. That's fine. So, yeah, so if you can, um, I guess, uh, Gloria, you can get her your email address to send the pictures over to. And uh, we can uh, do our research from there. We'll get your offer back uh, probably pretty quickly uh, as soon as we take a look at those photos. Is that okay with you? Sure. And, like, you know, I'm um, half multiple. So just let's start wanting to see how you can do. And if we can have me on both sides, work together, I can consider to have all the house go out to Oh, all right. Yeah. So, so how, how many properties are you looking to sell? Yeah, because currently I still have some other house and have a good tenant in there. But even though I can transfer to whoever that wanted to buy it and, you know, just extend the contract until the term is done and then the new owner wants to do whatever with them. But so far, those tenants they take good care of good house. They call me even the payday. They call me. Let me know they already been a check, so they are good. Oh, yeah. But I love though, great tenants. I still want to get... Huh? Yep, yep. That's so fine. that's fine. So we buy houses with tenants in them as well, so that's not a problem. So, yeah. How many houses did you have that you wanted to sell? Well, I have multiple houses. Let's just, just go with this one first, and then we will talk the other one. Oh, okay. We Does might want to buy them all. Going? You never know. <laughs> I'm sorry. Say so we may want to buy them all, but we'll 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 cross that bridge when we get to it. No problem. Other than that, Michelle, did you have yeah. any other questions or anything yeah. for me? Well, like I said, I said, yeah, I I want to get out of it. So if we can make a more transaction for one and both have, both are happy, I would go forward with you. Perfect, perfect. That sounds fair. Mm -hmm. Um, and so, did you have any uh -huh. other questions or anything for me before we let you go? Oh, 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 oh,